Hey guys, welcome to Tormented Souls. It's a uh, Resident Evil-esque, OG Resident Evil-esque game. And um, I've always, I've had my eye on it and it has looked really cool. You know, let's go, just jump right in. Published by P-Cube. Already like the graphics. Art style is not too bad. Uh, developed by Dual Effect Abstract Digital Works. Kudos to them. Link in the description for their info. A letter for me? I never receive letters. All right, well, we're already getting, a, you, they did the OG sound and you can inspect stuff. I already can kind of see that, that's cool. Um, can I open this? Okay, I just look at it. From John Doe, Wilberger Hospital, Winnipeg, okay. Uh, Blackwood, uh, hmm. What do, I, what do I do with this? Can I just like, oh, okay, there's, I look inside. Ah, uh, my head, what was that? Oh, didn't you just think you could simply abandon us here, huh? Okay. So what? Why are we here? In two weeks since I received that letter from the Wildberger Hospital. Since then, I haven't been fine. I can't get out of my head the image of those little girls. I can't sleep. And when I am able to fall asleep, it's only to dream horrible nightmares. I need to know what's going on. What's the meaning of all of this? I'm going to the Wildberger Hospital in hopes of finding some answers about this strange photo. I need to know what's going on. Oh, dude, yeah, this is Resident Evil 1 all day. Jesus. All right, you know, snooping. Uh-oh, what's going on? Oh, damn. She got slapped. That sucks. Alright, maybe we're about to start getting into the gameplay. I don't really know what to expect here. Whoa! Um. Ma'am. Devs. <clears throat> um. Let's, uh. Oh, oh my gosh. Full booba. Uh, yep, that's getting blurred out. Oh, man. This is all getting blurred out, bro. What is. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm literally looking behind me right now. What the heck? <laughs> Jesus, what the? I did not expect this game to have nudity. It's freaking out, dude. Okay, she just conveniently found her clothes. That's all right. I'm fine with that. I'd rather, you know, have my clothes than uh, <laughs> run around naked the entire game. That'd be kind of, that'd be awkward. I'd have to blur the entire game out, basically, my entire playthrough. What happened to her? I, what the heck? Oh, she's like, well, what's under it? Okay, what's going on? Oh! She lost her eyeball, and it's like a clean cut. What the heck? How do you surgically remove someone's eye that good within that time frame? That's crazy. Please tell me she put the bandage back on. I really, I really hope she did. Alright, so... Let me figure out these controls. Okay, so, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Tank. The tank controls, buddy. The good stuff. Alright. 
anything going on with this book nothing special today is the happiest day of my life yada yada after all suffering and i'm loving my wife she loved me in her eye and I okay oh my boy <laughs> gotta sneeze excuse me okay items resources okay we can open that there's a locket can we open this i would assume so hey i'll lock it shows the time old photograph two young twins cool okay padlock holding mm. so we got to figure out the combination for that that's cool do not let shadows embrace you okay can't open that just yet doorknobs missing great maybe it's in that locked uh, thing let's let's look around first see if we can find anything useful oh god yeah, mm -hmm, yeah already read that uh what's this frustrated da -da, what did it do this to me okay okay I don't really, mm, instruction sheet, okay, wow, yeah, oh, tank controls, yep, mm -hmm. how to open doors, that's keyboard and mouse and controller, I like that, cool, 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 pretty straightforward, I do, I do like that very much, okay, so, literally, literally just like the old, uh, Resident Evil games, I can dig that, so we're gonna have to figure out this combination, I, I don't really understand this, like, where are we supposed to find this uh, combination? I, I really don't. I don't get it. Yeah, there's that. No. <laughs> yeah, respirator. Okay. Like, what, what are we? What are you? <laughs> like, dude, come on. Throw me a bone here. There's no. I don't see any numbers anywhere. <laughs> hmm. There are no numbers anywhere in, in this room I've noticed so far. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Oh, no, I don't know, man. I already read that. This would like, come on. Is, is this gonna be like this? Where you just, you're not gonna throw me a little bone here? You know, it's just show me a hint. Let me check my resource files. Examine. Let's look at this again. Maybe it's something. Maybe it has something to do with this. I see the picture or photograph. To okay, not really. Maybe no. The hands weren't moving. I don't know. Maybe. Let's check. Let's read the book. Let's read the book. Uh, Marie insists the sign. She started using her lucky number. Uh, the hour as her lucky number and uses it for everything. I maybe, maybe it has something to do with the hour. I don't, hmm. Let, okay, hmm. Hangy. Let's, uh, let's see. Okay, so we got, uh, like, seven, so that's what, 35, 12, I don't, let me, let me just mess, let's just try, let me mess around, see what happens. Okay, so, we got, okay, so, one, two, three, four, five, okay, seven, let's say if it's seven, maybe, uh, See, maybe seven o'clock no am i reading the hands wrong it looked like it was seven o'clock or like is it rounding out or see i don't understand there's not really much it's it's given me here hmm that's what it's doing the 700 like seven o'clock let's let's look at the clock again let's let's see okay so Seven. Okay, but maybe that's because that's that might be the longer hand. Oh, what's behind? What's this? Time stood still. One, two, two angels. So, da. so maybe I'm reading it wrong. Maybe the sevens like thirty-five, and it's twelve thirty-five. I don't really. Hmm. I might. Maybe I'll try that. Twelve thirty-five. Let's. Twelve thirty-five. Oh, we got it. Let's go. First puzzle down, yes sir. Okay, old rusty. Okay, so we got a wrench, okay. I assume you open it because it's square, you, you mess with the wrench a certain way. Let's see if the wrench just works right off the bat. Use, there we go. Oh, oh, do you have to actually mess with the wrench? Hold on. No, combine, no, that's not gonna work. Let's, let's try it. Can you like, oh, okay. Um. Let's try that. That might be too wide. We'll try it though. Okay, that's awkward. <laughs> Jeez, it's that actually. It's that specific, huh? Let's let's close it, I guess. Then 
Open it once, and we'll try that. Let's see if that works. Oh, snap. First puzzle, achievement unlocked. Let's go. Okay, it's pretty dark. I don't know if I want to go in that corner over there. It's like ridiculously dark. Let's check in, let's check over here. Spooky doll, I like it. He's got something in his hand. Ooh, a lighter, let's go, okay. Okay, why is it? It got a lot darker when I grabbed that. I'm wondering if I need to use the lighter to see. Nope, wrong button. Okay, so where's it? Resources? Okay, equip. Let's try that. Hey, we got a light source. Let's go. Can't go that way, I guess? Hmm. Maybe... Hmm. I'm just clicking around, seeing if there's anything I'm missing. Because, you know, this is the kind of game where you just click constantly and you could miss anything that's the only thing that stinks about these kind of games it's fun though it's fun but anything could be clickable okay we're going in the darkness it, i don't like that what's in here the waiting room okay okay yep yep all right we're already getting a spooky start i like that okay some clip of nails is that where the weapon comes into play here's where the nail or some a nail gun as a weapon that's kind of sick Tribe Samuru Tribe are in uh, 500 years before uh, more than 200 uh, All the bones were buried. Okay. Some old tribe. It's just referencing. Don't know why it's referencing an old tribe. Maybe that'll come into play with the story. Operated by a. I don't have that. Definitely. Pharmacy service window. Nothing special in there. Let's check what's in here. Could be some examination room. Let's see. Oh, 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 that's save music. Is this a save room? Oh, what's this? Uh, left side of a plastic heart. Okay, okay. I can dig it. It's probably got to find the other side of the plastic heart. That's cool. Excuse me. Okay, that looks like the save thing. But it's looking like... Oh, medical books and useful. Oh, you can click that. Oh, nothing special, though. Hey, seven-inch tape. Use to record information. Okay, that's probably the save, I would assume. All files, nothing serious. I don't think, I think, mm. I'm gonna do that. Report information. Do I wanna save? It'd be kinda early to use that. Cause it's limited. I don't know if I wanna though. Um, maybe if you hit record or something. Okay, that's how you save. An old magnetophone. It looks like it works. Recording my progress might be useful if anything happens to me. My name is Caroline Walker. I came to Wild Burger Mansion seeking information about two girls in a photograph I received in the mail a couple of weeks ago. The last thing I remember before losing consciousness was arriving at the hospital and entering the mansion's main hall. I remember pain and then nothing. I woke up sometime later connected to a ventilation machine. And my eye had been removed. Why? Why would someone do such a thing? I don't know what the hell is going on in this place, but I need answers. Every time I close my eyes, I see those girls. Am I going insane? Fire saved. Oh, you got an achievement for saving. That's nice of him. Yep. Yep. It's literally just like Resident Evil. It's limited. Okay, that that could be bad. That could bite me in the ass, you know. <laughs> Excuse me, Jesus. Not this doll. Okay, spooky dolls. I don't know why there's so many spooky dolls locked. Fears to be open. Okay, that's great. So I gotta find the power. I don't know. I have no clue where I'm going really. Pharmacy service window. Nothing not there. Uh, probably go back then. I, dude, I'm like so confused right now. Maybe it's it, probably back. I'm gonna have to backtrack because I really. Mm, no, no, no. I checked everything in this room. East one corridor. All right. What is that sound? Is that rain? That was a weird sound. Uh, that looks like you only can electronically open that one too. I keep hearing a sound. Okay, I don't I don't even understand that. Uh, let's 
terrified that William would do in front of him. I think it's getting my first one. Why wow, this whip? William asked me why he did it. Of course, I explained on the pain. Gmail. Okay. Okay. A lot of these diaries, I don't know if they're supposed to help me. What was it? What's over here? Let's check. Okay. Ooh, a map. Okay. Let's go. I like maps. Maps are helpful. This is where we are. This is where we are. Um, those red rooms, I guess they have stuff in them. Uh, I would assume it would go by that, you know, rule of thumb, like Resident Evil usually does. And I think I can check it whenever, right? Yeah, okay. But yeah, I would, I would believe it'd go by that. Judith heading, painted by da, 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 1602. It depicts Judith behind the room. Uh, okay. Looks like the original. Maybe. So paintings might have a significance later. I don't really know. I feel as though everything's going to have a significance in this game. Let's go down the spooky steps, see what we find. Oh boy. I saw a generator sign, so I would assume this is the way to turn on the power. Oh, what's down here? Oh, locker, what we got, what we got? A hex socket, missing handle. Okay, okay. That's gonna be useful for a puzzle later. Oh, patient, patient report. Hospital patient transplant. The patient passed away. 11:34 due to cardiac arrest. Okay. Uh, I'll, I'll look back at those if I do any puzzles. Oh, more nails. Good, good. I got ammo, so you know when I get my gun, I'll be killing. I'll be chilling, killing and chilling, chilling and killing. All right, it got really quiet. Oh, speed racer, where you going, bud? Yep. Hmm. Don't know if I want to go that way. Yeah, we're gonna, we're not gonna touch that one. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. I don't know if I want to mess with that. Let's, let, well, you know, I'll be a thug about it. Why not? Let's uh not go left though. Let's uh let's go this way. And see what we find. Okay, that's a nice shot. Oh, very nice, mutilated. Look at them guts hanging out the the bottom. I like that. Okay. All right, so we're gonna be thugs. And go check it out. Well, that's an interesting statue. Okay. Atmosphere is already spooking me out. Uh, anything clickable over there? What's down this way? Uh, maybe I'll go. I'll go down the steps. I'll find out what I see. Oh, hey, first encounter. Without any weapons. Great. All right. What's behind me? Oh, look at you. Yeah. Okay, all right, through the door. That's locked, great. Um, he's kind of fast, kind of not. Let's go, yeah, all right. Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah. Hello? What the hell is going on here? Very good question. You are pale. What happened to you? A person in a wheelchair with knives in his hands was chasing me. Oh, it's you. Don't you remember me? I'm the town priest. We met here in the chapel only a couple of days ago. No, what? we didn't. I'm sorry. I don't remember you. I certainly don't remember coming here before. I see. Perhaps I'm mistaken. I'm old and get confused every now and again. What is going on here, Father? Where is everybody? The patients and the hospital personnel have been transferred to the new hospital in town. This old mansion has been left pretty much abandoned. Why are all the lights off? I don't like this. I feel the same. Something evil is happening here. Something wicked that hides in the shadows. Is there a way to turn on the lights? The old generator has been playing up. It happens sometimes. Go to the end of the hall and through the door that leads to the generator room. You can restore the power from there. I see. I'll do that. Wait. Take this with you. It's not much, but it might be useful. 
It's dangerous to walk around the mansion unarmed. Thank you, Father, but what are you going to do without a weapon? My child, with a Bible in my hand, God protects me. Hell yeah, brother. Wait, no, that shouldn't have said that. <laughs> um, 20 minutes is a pretty long time for uh, play playtime, so I think right here is probably a good spot. You know, I'm gonna show off the new gun. Looks pretty good. But um, I'm gonna end this here, and then uh, we'll continue after in the next part. Um, yep, hope you guys enjoyed the first part of um, Tormented Souls, and I'll see you in the next part. Bye, guys.